the first update of Harvex in 2024. So this is big news. Let's start with the two new cars. Oh, they're at the very end. No way. The first ever Ferrari. This is huge. What is the other one? Oh, it's the Mitsubishi, right? I believe like 3000 GT or something like that. So this is cool. How good is this vehicle, by the way? It's 1 million and it's a Ferrari. That's cool crazy we're gonna have to make it red like there is not even a question i don't even know why it comes in yellow let's slap on ultimate over here because we're not gonna be racing with it what we are gonna do is obviously use a 90 adhesion we're gonna make the rear tires a little smaller because we want less grip probably gonna go with like 30 profile over here and maybe lower it as well like so problem has been solved yeah we're gonna lower all this but first body kit is over here. I mean, look at this. No, no, it's 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 ugly. Second body kit, however, is this one. Now this one feels a little better. And the last one, please don't be crazy. Oh my god, this is even more rice. Oh no. We need to go with the stock one. We just have to. Now the roof option though. Was there a black roof option? I want to know. Oh, that is kind of cool. But we are gonna keep it red. But the rims we are gonna have to change. I think I might as well go with these actually yeah just maybe give it a little bit of shine and should be good it is time to test out the vehicle how good is it sideways let me actually see if there's online service as well we're right now on ptr boys don't you worry it will be in the normal version very soon and also it will be on console boys it will be on console oh boys the map is like 3d well not 3d but there's like colors you can see where the forest area is and everything that's pretty neat okay first test let's see how it is on a wheel i haven't even done a proper tune over here and it's pretty easy to keep sideways i mean look at this i can even actually use one hand i'm not gonna be using the handbrake the car is super smooth like to be fair the latest cars car X have added have all been pretty good this one i think is pretty top tier wait he has the ferrari as well okay we're gonna do a ferrari tandem then you want to go why are your tires blue by the way okay he's going hold on hold on okay he's way too fast for me why is everybody using like 120 at easy and this man can't keep thousand horsepower under control apparently car is good boys car is good wait there's a jump as well over here we can take there we go little hops over there uh very cool but the other car it can't be better than the ferrari i mean the ferrari was really insane so let's buy that gonna put it 100 adhesion over here as well and i think that should be fine oh we gotta make the tire smaller as well and it seems we're gonna lower the car a bit so it looks kind of like that now on the engine it's 965 okay we're not gonna we're gonna go like half that i believe i don't want to know if we go with the racing oh boys on racing setup this car unlike the ferrari this one is always drive actually so this is gonna be a really good drag car okay we're going with fresh blue and maybe black rims on this one okay there we go tinted the windows rims are black we got two bunny kits over here this is stock obviously and d master over here is like just absolutely bananas it's like a hot wheels car i don't know what happened over here oh uh, let's see the other one hopefully this is clean please be clean oh my god what is that i think we gotta use the stock one let me see what kind of bumper options do we have one bumper option dude that looks like an Aston Martin. Am I tripping right now? I think I'll go with that. Let me see. Hood options. Okay, might, might as well rise it out maybe a little bit. Yeah, I'll put it like so. Okay, roof option. We got these. Oh, we got the transparent roof. Nice. Okay, let's see the trunks. Huh? Trunks just comes with a spoiler? I didn't ask for a spoiler. Okay, th there's a lot of spoilers though. That's not a bad spoiler. It kind of fits. Now, there are bumpers over here. I think I'll go with this one. It adds like this darker area over here, which is not bad. Car is ready. Let's test it out. Okay, it seems also smooth it sounds like a like a muscle car dude this is also so good wait we actually got two really good drift cars are you kidding me okay boys this is even smoother than the ferrari this is actually crazy this is gonna be one of the best drift cars in car X. i'm not even kidding okay the cars are good but there is more that came with the update we got body kits and for this one it should be called street x just gonna make it blue for a second so 
just so you can take the body kit in. So stock one looks like that. And the street X is... Oh my... What is... <laughs> what are you... Why? Just why? <laughs> I mean, it's 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 a cool racing body kit, but my goodness, definitely stands out. Now, there is another new body kit for the S13 over here, you can see the icon. So this is the default vehicle right over there, and we're gonna try out the custom. So the custom is, wow, I really like it. Wait, that's actually good, like this is minimalistic. Uh, car developer, these are the body kits we want. Also, they added new rims called Turbo Fans, based on the name, it's Sounds really weird. Oh my god. Wait, is that a whole section? Oh no. Carex, what, what are you doing? So these are the new rims, ladies and gentlemen, right there. Oh, we're gonna see so many of these in every online lobby. People are gonna be using this. I mean, this is a dream come true right there, right? Why even add custom maps to console players if we could have these goofy rims? What else is new with the update? Favorite section for the rims. Ooh. Okay, let me try to add one. I know there's a couple of rims which I really do like. For example, these rims. And now, if I press T or click the button over here, then they are favorited. And now, if I go out and go into rims, I go into this tab over here, favorites, then the rims are here and I can buy them. That's, that's really cool. That's like a quality of life update. Various types of carbon were added. Oh, I think they just added a lot of carbon updates, maybe. Now, they also say livery delivery system was reworked server connection was optimized to minimize ping spikes and freezes in multiplayer mode yeah the issue was all the guys with liveries when they joined the server the server kind of like just blew up and just started like flickering in like one fps per second it was horrible so hopefully that is fixed now vfx particles support added is that a graphics update i wonder graphics that is, that is one of the new options. I've never seen volumetric fog. Then they say number of track-based components were increased. Additional road settings were added. Oh, I think they mean road textures. And they fixed some kind of a Sony controller issue as well. Then a bug fix, which is very specific. Hey, we did a bug fix. That's cool. What, what did you fix? Now, Carrick, you're probably gonna focus on two things. First of all, console players are still waiting on the workshop maps. Maybe throw a bone for console players as well. Second of all, Carrick, please fix the hacking issue. Like right over here on this example, you're playing and the server dies. That means someone just deleted your lobby. So people can do that. People have like admin tool or whatever softwares. They can just delete anyone's lobbies. Over three months we have waited for an update and all we basically got was two cars. That is the current state of Carrick. Console players, you're probably gonna like get the modded maps maybe in 10 years at this pace uh, i guess all we can do is hope so boys hopefully you enjoyed this humble update video if you did like and subscribe and as always stay sideways peace